Hi everyone, I got my Brambleberry order in. I make homemade soap and I ordered some soap making supplies and I almost always get all my uh, supplies from Brambleberry. It's been a while since I ordered because I did stock up one time so I hadn't, I haven't had to order anything. But I decided to order some new fragrances and I love how Brambleberry packs their boxes. They use these neat inflatable or or foam things. I don't know even know how they work, but it like activates and wraps itself right around what you order. And I did order some sandalwood. Sent you a sandalwood scent. And they always throw in something free, a free sample, and my free sample is ooh, lemon cake. That should be interesting. I'll have to smell that one. And let's see what we got here. Oh, things tucked all over. Let's see. Oh, there's, I gotta be careful. There's a jar in here. Ugh. There we go. Oh, this is my wasabi. I know everyone's thinking, ew, wasabi fragrance, but oh, it smells so good. So I, I did order a large uh, wasabi. And castor oil, because I'm almost out of castor oil. And I put uh, castor oil in almost all my soaps. And I got something new. This is vitamin, vitamin E oil. It is very expensive. But I just thought I'd put it in like some special soaps that I'm making and you don't need that much it's just a you know three four drops I'm guessing uh, for like three pounds of soap and I got some pigments I got burgundy pigment and this is an awful big jar but they must they must have been out of the little jars because normally it comes in a smaller jar and brown oxide because I want to use this for my sandalwood soap but that's one thing that I like about brambleberry like let's say uh, you know they're out of the small jars to put their colorings in you don't have to wait till they get smaller jars in they just use what they have then and I'll just put all these back in here for now until I can get them in my soap making cabinet but that's what I got from Brambleberry. Thanks for watching. Bye.